It's all about shrimps, simply shrimps. Good day everybody and welcome to this video where we'll be talking about the Hamburg Matten filter or the HMF filter for short or quite possibly even the Hamburger mm -mm Matten filter that one was just a joke but I have them in one, two, three of my four shrimp tanks and I'm just gonna show you or tell you about how they work so my HMF filters are actually run off of an air pump and I've got this one air pump running all four. You can have them run off uh, small power heads but obviously the more tanks you have the more electricity it's going to use up so I use an air pump. I love the fact that you can actually hide things behind it so you can see the heaters hidden away there. Uh, also some of the airline tubing goes in the back. I've got the thermometer hidden behind there and there's even an overflow that I drilled in for making water changes slightly more easier. So how it actually works is uh, you see the blue tubing there is the air stone that goes into the back of the PVC piping uh, and as the bubbles rise they actually draw the water in from the bottom and as they go over that right angle and pull the water through there as well causing a flow across the surface of the tank and you can see the bubbles there they're actually being shot out across the tank uh, as much as I hate duckweed you can actually see the good current of the duckweed moving on the surface so that's one way I use to tell that I've got a good enough flow it's the fact that there's actually a good water flow at the other end of the tank to where the filter is so as the water flow actually gets to the other side of the tank it's then bounce back to the other side of the tank where the filter is and that's where it's drawn through the sponge and the mechanical filtration of that sponge will get out most of the debris some might get through but I'll get onto that in a moment and because the sponge is about two inches thick that I've got using here it provides a massive surface area for the biological bacteria to actually colonize in I love watching the shrimp crawl across the surface of the Hamburg Matten filter. I think it's because they pop against the contrast of the blue or the black, whichever colour sponge uh, you're using. And it's just fascinating watching them eating. So here's a view from the top so you can just see the whole water flow. Uh, my duckweed, as I said, as much as I hate it, is showing a prime example of the direction of flow so you can see how it sort of goes down the middle and then back down the sides towards the filter. This is a great example. Another thing I love about the filter, I, I just love so much about the filter, but another thing I love about it is the fact that any waste that gets through the uh, filter sponge itself, it settles at the back and it's nice and easy to siphon out uh, without the risk of sucking up shrimps or even baby shrimps or any small fish is just so safe just to stick the siphon behind there, siphon all the waste out and everyone's hunky-dory. Same goes for when you're filling the water back up, if you just bung it straight in the back you see it was quite vigorous but in the main front of the tank or the, the actual shrimp living area or fish living area it's pretty dandy, I mean they're not getting disturbed too much, the only disturbance you can see there is the uh, Blumming duckweed getting forced down by the force of the water coming out of the PVC piping but other than that I love the backspace you can utilize it in so many different ways so that's the end of this video everybody and I hope you enjoyed it if you did then be sure to whack that thumbs up uh, definitely if you've learned something about the Hamburg Mountain filter and how it actually works and for more shrimpy videos don't forget to subscribe as I'm bringing them out weekly. And I'll see you in another video, everybody. See you later. It's all about shrimps, simply shrimps. Let's get some shrimp, oh, simply shrimps.